Okay, what's up everybody? Welcome to the recap. And look, I want to start this week's recap with a, 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 a shout out for a recap favorite. This week, Howie Rose was elected to the New York Baseball Hall of Fame. And you may know Howie Rose is the uh, radio voice of the New York Mets. It's, I'm really happy for him. It's great. Uh, let's have a, a recap shout out for Howie Rose. Good for you, Howie. Now, by the way, uh, Ron Darling and Art Shamsky were also elected, and they'll be inducted with Howie on November 3rd. And you may recall that uh, Howie once had a uh, call-in show after Mets games on the fan. And uh, you may recall the time that I actually uh, reached him and got on the air. Uh, I think I was Eddie from Queens on that, uh, on that call. Well, okay. Uh, several weeks ago, I, I showed a video of my brother and my sister talking about what they liked and uh, didn't like on the recap. And I invited you to uh, send in your request for things you'd like me to cover. And uh, a number of you did. And one of them was uh, our Cambodian correspondent, Bob McCarthy, who requested a food review. And I've got one, and I'll tell you what it is. Uh, Burger King just announced a uh, meatless Whopper. So what I did was to go and check it out for you. Here it is. Well, I've come to, uh, to this Burger King to uh, try this. An impossible Whopper. I know everybody wants to know what it's all about, and I'm about to tell you. And uh, let me say at the outset that when you get the impossible Whopper, they, they also give you a crown, a paper crown that you can wear. It's, uh, it's kind of stupid and it doesn't fit on my head, but anyway, you, you can have fun with that. So uh, let, me, uh, let me open this up and uh, we'll take a look at it. There it is. Right, let's open the bun. It's got a uh, pretty good assortment of stuff, and uh, if you look closely, it looks like uh, the thing looks like it's actually meat. But the uh, the issue is, uh, what does it taste like? It's hard really to tell because you got all this ketchup and tomatoes and whatnot. If you look, if you look at the inside of it, the th it looks, it really looks like meat. It's kind of, uh, kind of got the texture of meat. I've got to be honest. I'm, I'm not a, a Burger King fan. I'm not, in fact, fast food I regard as pretty much just fried schmutz. And I'm certainly not a, a Whopper fan. This, um, this tastes like, uh, tastes kind of uh, bad to me. And uh, I don't know, I suppose it's got the texture of meat, but... Uh, and it sure looks a little bit burned on the edges. Um, but, and it, I, I don't know how much you can see on the inside of this. Uh, thing I would say is I went in there and I got a uh, uh, Impossible Whopper and a small Diet Coke, which is really not all that small. That cost me $9.95. This is, that's, that's $9.95, quite frankly, down the toilet. Anyway, here's, here's a food review. And I'm spending this out in particular to uh, Bob McCarthy in uh, Cambodia. Um, okay, let's get back to the show. 
Yeah, I'll tell you what. I mean, it's uh, way too expensive. It doesn't taste really like anything very much as far as I'm concerned. And uh, I'm, I'm just not a Burger King guy anyway. So anyway, there you go. I, I tried it. You don't have to. And, uh, you know, if, if you think you're going to like it, uh, give it a whirl. Well, this week I spent the... Uh, uh, majority of the time uh, shooting, not doing particular projects, but I was practicing with some equipment that I've got because we're going on a trip and uh, I want to travel as light as possible and I still want to get the best video I can. Uh, so the upshot of that is I did a lot of practice shots, which I'm not going to burden you with, uh, but uh, next week uh, you should uh, see the results of that. And uh, you should see a recap coming from uh, a somewhat exotic location. Now, in the meantime, have a great weekend. By the way, uh, this weekend at the Legion, uh, Saturday, uh, the Sons of the American Legion are having their annual August barbecue. So uh, come on down. I have no idea how much it costs or anything like that. But, uh, you know, they welcome having you there. Anyway, uh, if you're not coming, have a great weekend anyway, and we'll see you next week. Take care.